very quickly came, became a program that wasn't even on my radar to one that, that was at the top of my list. The reason that I chose to come to Winnipeg for thoracic surgery was that amongst the programs in Canada, I thought this was the most balanced. It had the best diversity of types of pathology. Uh, it had a wide range of um, therapeutic approaches. Uh, including some advanced endoscopic techniques that are really not offered in any other training program in Canada. I think we're a big enough group that you get exposed to a broad a variety of techniques and, and um, kind of personal preferences, um, but we're also small enough that we all have a good sense of what everybody else is doing and we're, we're kind of a tight-knit family as a result of that. We deal with a lot of cancers, lung, esophageal, that are both pretty devastating to a person's you know, length of life, but also their quality of life, and that require a lot of tests in anticipation to the treatment. So we actually built a comprehensive center that can actually take patients throughout that entire process. So from diagnosis, to staging, to treatment, and then to palliation even all in one place. And on top of that, because we have control over the unit, we have also people coming from all over the province to have their procedures done. You need all of those tools at your disposal when you finish. And I think that Manitoba, probably more than any other place, gives you that exposure. Uh, right now I'm operating five days a week and then more when I'm on call. And if I wanted the surgeons to call me for cases overnight, they would. We are interested in residents here and we're interested in them succeeding and their success, we feel, is our success. I know that where I trained previously, um, mentorship was something that you had to fight for, and the surgeons here view mentorship as a key part of what they do, but I think it's everything. I think it's the difference between a, as one of my surgeons puts it, uh, the difference between an okay surgeon and the difference between a great surgeon. But what I find actually the most gratifying and the most personal are the, are the personal stories of people that come tell you that this is possible and you can deliver care like this. Of course, you can do it yourself. When you leave, you can fight to make it work and you have a model to look to. 